Hello everybody, my name is Dude, and welcome to Eternal Radiance, a JRPG in development by whoever's in the description, because I didn't think to look at that at the start. This is just a demo. Uh, yeah, this is just a demo. The game's still in development, as I said. I don't know how far along they are, so think this might not be a super great reflection of the final product, because I think they were going to rework the map and maybe some of the beginning and stuff, so it's just a demo! It's fine. We're going to see how it works. Uh, by the way, slight note, I don't know if controllers work. Oh, they do. Okay, you've come a long way, Celeste. Thank you, sir! Oh, no, I, I remember I did that invert. I remember when you first joined us! You looked so small then! I could scarcely imagine you'd grow up into such a fine squire! Yeah, it's a visual novel slash JRPG, so JRPG, basically. It's, it's kind of like how they seem to work, I think? I hope controller works, I wasn't informed of this. I do my best, sir. Where is he going with this? I called you here today because I have a special mission for you! Just me, sir? That's right! I will, it will be difficult, but I'm confident you can handle it! Never done a solo mission before, but if the leader of our order has faith in me, I'll give it my best shot. As I said, you've come a long way! It's not good to keep a promising squire like you behind our walls! It's nice for you to prove- it's time for you to prove yourself! Does he mean what I think he means? I hope not! Or maybe a different thing, what? What? Okay, I didn't read the thing before the pop-up! This is your initiation, Celeste. Complete this task and you'll be recognized as a true knight of the Ashen Order! New main quest from Sir Zacharias. A knight's initiation. Uh, slight note, and you probably fix this later on. It's totally fine, but like, maybe do the quest notification after the dialogue's been moved on. And then before the next one. So, like, in between the last dialogue saying, here's this quest, and then before the one that's like, Fuck yeah, got it! Yes, after all this time. I won't let you down, sir. I'm glad to hear it. You don't need to look quite so nervous, though. I know this is a proud occasion. I haven't passed yet, sir. It's only a matter of time. He's really that confident in my skills? I've been doing better in practice, but this is the real deal. Still, this is finally it. I'll finally be a knight. I can't wait to write home with the good news. Now, as you know, the Ashen Order was founded to protect people from the dangerous monsters that roam our world! Yes, sir. When Durencia's civilization was struggling to survive due to the constant danger, the Order's founders banded together to fight off threats so that humanity could flourish. This isn't a quiz, Squire. I'm ex I'm giving exposition for the people that don't know what the hell's going on. Like dude run here. Hello. I wasn't paying attention in class. Sorry. Since you're so interested in demonstrating your knowledge, what is the second half of our mission? Finding, containing, and studying the artifacts left behind in by the Acclaim? 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 A claim? Uh, I don't know how to pronounce that. That word, sir. Correct! Due to the nature of the artifacts, the two are often intertwined. Such is the case with your mission. Sir, you're sending me to retrieve one of the artifacts? Uh, that's right! Isn't that dangerous for a squire? This artifact has only surfaced recently. It shouldn't be beyond your capabilities. But still, the F. The effects of the artifacts are said to be terrible. Part of being a knight is having faith in your own skills. Shouldn't a knight also know when they need backup? True. If you assess the situation and determine it to be too much for you, after all, I would expect you to report back immediately. Where's the artifact, sir? It's in a forest near the south, well, near the town of Ancora. There's a ship waiting for you. Follow me. La -de -da -de -da -de -da -de -da -da Celeste is just like, what the fuck is going on? Why is Zacharias talking like that? Why is he dabbing every other so every so often? As usual, this place is bustling with activity. Zacharias just dabbed in into a person's face and now they're unconscious. 
There are the squires training, the knights running through their own practice exercises over there. I even see a few researchers discussing their latest attempts to understand the artifacts. After so many years, this place has become my home. It will feel strange leaving, if it's even if it's just for a mission. What's reaching and Korra? Fucking game! No! Do the dialogue first, then the obtained items. Don't, like, let the thing complete and then just, like, here you go! It throws me off. Once you reach in core, gather as much information as you can to proceed safely, retrieve the artifact, and then return to the ship. Here! Yeah, you already gave me the thing. What's this? I don't know! I just kind of gave it to you when my dialogue finished, rather than waiting for the player to hit A! on the controller, which thankfully works, I wasn't informed. Carry the artifact of this pouch for your own safety. The cloth has been enchanted by our mages to contain the artifact's power. All right. Do you have any more questions before you leave? Uh, no questions, I'm good. In that case, it's time for you to be off. Fuck, dude. They're all like this. I hope that changes in the final product, because holy shit, that throws me off. It's a little jarring to just let the dialogue run its course and then get the quest dialogue and stuff, instead of, like, waiting until I hit A to do it, and then you're good. It's like, have two A button triggers, or two next dialogue triggers, and then have the little quest dialogue in between the two. So, like, they press A, they get the thing, and they press A again to actually move on to the next thing. Right. The ship is waiting for you! And Lux Celeste, do the SC Nord are proud! I will, sir. I haven't been on a ship since I first became a squire. My parents were so proud of me when they had to leave. Everything suddenly felt so final. I knew I wouldn't see them again for years. I wanted to run back and beg them to stay with me. I knew they wouldn't. My only dream would have been to go home with them and give up on my dream. So I composed myself and tried to look strong, like a knight. And when the ship left the port, I started to cry anyway. So Zacharias was the one who calmed me down. I felt like I'd humiliated myself, but he assured me that everyone felt that way sometimes. There was no shame in showing emotions, he said. Compassion is not weakness. Yes! Yes, that, that is correct. That is correct, people. You can cry if you want to. That is not a sign of weakness. True men let their emotions flow. Don't, like, hide that shit. They say that because toxic masculinity is a horrible thing and it needs to stop. And it's, Yeah. <laughs> it's been a long time since I thought about that day. It left me more determined than ever to become a knight just like Sir Zacharias so I could protect people. Well, this is it. I have to help the people of Ancora. And once I do, I'll become a full knight in the Ashen Order. Whatever happens, I won't fail! But it's gonna be a while before we reach Ancora, so I might as well make myself comfortable. A well-rested knight is ready for anything. Except, uh, stabbing in the bed. I don't mean like... I don't mean like, eh -eh -eh, I mean like, zink, 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 that kind of thing. It was a long journey, but at last, the knight at last, the ship entered the waters of the Azure Bay and docked at Ancora. My mission had officially begun. So this is Ancora. Um... So many people here. Ah, who do I talk to? Where do I go? Don't panic, don't panic. Are you alright? Ah! Person! Sorry, I didn't mean to startle you. My name is Ruby. Celeste. I'm with the Ashen Order. Huh. What? Oh, sorry. Just aren't what I expected from the Ashen Order, that's all. It's a little and I'm still a squire. That explains it then. Are you here on your own? Yep! This is my first official mission. It's my initiation. Congratulations. I haven't passed yet. From what I've heard about the Ashen Order standards, even reaching this point is a big accomplishment. Ah, well, thank you. Uh, my trainer likes to dab at people, which unfortunately means that we have a lot of head injuries, but it's okay, because we have good health care in the area. So, do you need help? 
and I know what I'm supposed to do. Enough panicking. Can you tell me anything about the strange incidents that have bleh, that have occurred in the forest lately? I'm afraid I won't be much help to you there. I'm a stranger to Ankara too. You are? Yes, I come from up north. I'm a scholar, and I recently traveled to Ankara in pursuit of my research. Oh, I see. These incidents in the forest wouldn't have anything to do with a mysterious organization, would they? Not as far as I know. Oh, well, it was worth a try. That's what you're researching? A mysterious organization? Yes. Isn't that a little... vague? We don't know much about them. Most people doubt they even exist. I'm on my own when it comes to this research. I see. One day I'll find out what I'm looking for. Until then, I just have to keep working. For someone who isn't from this town, you sure seem comfortable here. That's because it's such a lovely place. Oh. You haven't traveled much, have you? Isn't that obvious? Yes. Well, I might not be from around here, but I can tell you one important thing about Ankara. What's that? If you enjoy fish, it has the best food ever. You don't like fish? Why would information about food be such an important thing? I like food! Celeste, you don't know food. You don't know the joys of food. It's good. Because it's delicious. I'm on, a, I'm on an important mission. You can't do an important mission without energy. Actually, I'm supposed to be gathering information about the area, not... And what better way to learn about Ankor than by trying its world-famous takoyaki? Ooh, takoyaki. Aha! <laughs> got your attention with that one, did I? My mom used to make takoyaki all the time back home. They sell the takoyaki right over there, so if you want to try some. Well, I guess it couldn't hurt. I'll just consider it part of my mission to understand Ankora better. That's the spirit. Follow me, it's this way. Oh my god. Is there a button that lets me, uh... Show the screen? Oh god, I skipped things. So they made the takoyaki with freshly caught fish? Well, well, sure, why not? This place isn't heavily polluted like it is in the real world. It must be more than just takoyaki, then. Of course there is. If you want, I'll give you a tour of all the best places to eat sometime. I'd like that. Good, maybe once you're done with your mission? Well, I'll need to report back right away. After that, though, I'll be a full night. I'm sure I'll be able to return to Ankara to see you. Perfect! Will you still be here, though? Since you're a visitor yourself and everything. Don't worry, if I have to move on before you return, I'll leave a message at the local inn so you know how to get in touch with me. Thanks. Local inn, huh? That sounds like a good place to gather information. So you said your mother used to make takoyaki? That's right. This is one of my favorites when I was a little girl. Don't you see your parents anymore? They don't live in Dorencia. We're only able, we've only had a few quick visits since I joined the Ashen Order. I understand. My parents live far away too. I still visit them regularly though. I've always supported my research. My parents supported my dream to become a knight. That reminds me, I'll have to respond to their letter sometime. What letter? Did we get a letter from them and haven't written back to them? Why the Ashen Order? Eh? I mean, you traveled to a different continent to join an order of knights. Why not become a warrior a little closer to home? Uh... I don't... I don't know. Uh, yeah, the Ashen Order is... The Ashen Order is elite. It's true that they have a pretty grand reputation. It's more than just a reputation. When it comes to their skills and expertise, the Ashen Order is second to none. So they didn't just want to become a knight, but the best of the best? Exactly. I wanted to sort out... I wanted the sort of training and opportunities only the Ashen Order could give me. You're proud to be a member, aren't you? Yes. In that case, they better not hold you up too long. You have a mission to complete. That's right. Thank you for the takoyaki, though. It was delicious. We'll have to do this again sometime. That we will! Uh, how much was it? I should pay you. Nonsense. It was my treat. Think of it as a token of our friendship. Friendship? But we just met. Or if you prefer, consider it a, a donation to the Ashen Order's cause. <laughs> Good luck on your mission. 
And if it helps at all, I've heard rumors about... I heard rumors that something strange had been happening in the forest. What sort of rumors? I've been focused on my own work, but it sounds like things are more dangerous around here than they usually are. Ask around. I'm sure you'll find people willing to talk about it. Thank you. I will. So far, so good. I already made contact with one person, and even got some delicious takoyaki out of it, too. Uh, I should start gathering information about the incidents in the forest. Since fishing is such a huge part of Ankora's livelihood, the fishermen must know something of what's going on. The gentleman there looks like he's just come from a fishing trip. Let's give it a try. Excuse me, sir. Huh? What do you want? You're a fisherman, right? That's right. One of the best. My name's Grady. I'm with the Ashen Order, and I've been here. I've been sent here to. Oh, so now the Ashen Order shows up. Well, we react as fast as we. Ha! <laughs> Excuse me. What's in here, Missy? Your Ashen Order doesn't care one bit about Ancor until there's something in it for them. Lord Aldous is the only one protecting us. What? Lord Aldous is no different. Sir Zacharias acted as soon as he heard the reports. Oh, I'll bet. Those reports sure do take a long time to reach that isolated fortress of yours. Since the Ashen Order deals with problems all across Dorencia, sometimes these things take time, but I assure you... And what did he do when he saw the report? Send some half-grown girl to hell? I am a squire about to become a full knight in the Order, thank you very much. That explains a lot about the Order. He's trying to rile me. They told me there would be situations like this. Defuse the situation. Try to find common ground. How's the fishing business? You know anything about fishing? Well, not much. Heh, <laughs> figures. I know it's vitally important to Ankara, however. That's right. Without fishing, this town be still be a tiny village. But, but do people remember to thank the fishermen? Of course not. I'm sorry. Life gets too good and people forget what makes that possible. Kids grow up wanting the luxury of this life without putting in the work. I'm sure the incidents in the forest haven't made things easier either. Darn right they haven't! Sure, it's fine out on the water, but how's anyone supposed to sell fish when people keep dying? Dying? Dying to them damned goblins out there. Ha! <laughs> we should have wiped them out years ago. You mean you've lived alongside goblins all this time, but it's only become a problem recently? That's what most people will tell you. But you know what? We should have never done it. Sure, we had a treaty with the goblins, but what good does that do us now? I keep looking at my phone thinking I'm getting a text. I'm not. It's just a nose thing. It just gave him time to grow strong. I'll handle your goblin problem. You will? Yeah, that's why I'm here. More or less. Ha! <laughs> now we're talking. Pop the buggers out. I'll do whatever seems necessary. Anyways, you want to know more about the problem heading into town. They've seen the worst of it. I'll do that. Thank you. I have work to do. Gotta make up for what I've lost. You just left as you were talking. Okay. Interesting. So the goblins in the forest have been causing problems for the people of Ankora. This must be the work of the artifact. It seems like it hasn't had a direct effect on the fishing trade yet. I'll take his advice and head deeper into town. There I should find people who can tell me what I need to know. I've only got two people to talk to. Oh, it's only the fishing area. Hmm. The market's a bit emptier than I would expect, given Ankara's size. I wonder if this is a side effect of the attacks. It looks like they sell just about everything here. Food, weapons, armor. Excuse me, could you give me a hand? Uh, me? Yes, you. I'm sorry to bother you, but you look pretty capable, and I'm not sure I can do this on my own. She appears to be struggling with some sort of vendor's tent? It looks a bit out of place. I don't see anything else like it around here. What exactly are you trying to do? I need to set up my stand, but I can't seem to get the tent open on my own. Why do you need a tent? In case it rains, of course. Everyone else seems to have more permanent structures. That seems better than a folding tent above a table. So, a little help here? Sure, I'll help. Why would I not? I'm here to help people! I should be helping people! What do you need me to do? Just grab the end there and pull outward. 
Outward? Don't you need it to go up? It needs to expand first. Well, alright. It's her tent. She should know. Let's grab this side and pull like she wants me to. Great, now the other side. For someone who has who was having so much trouble a minute ago, you sure seem to know what you're doing now. I practiced with another person. I just made the mistake of assuming I could do it alone once I knew how it worked. I don't think anyone can handle this alone, unless they had really long arms. Yeah, thank you for that. No problem. Helping people is why I'm here. Exactly! Phone, you want anything important? Nope, okay, I'm gonna just like... Do that, that, that... Boop, done, okay, good. You're not from Ankara, are you? No, I'm with the Ashen Order. My name is Celeste. Good to meet you, Celeste. I'm Ri. I'm an enchanter. An enchanter? Enchanting is a special type of magic that lets you add special properties to weapons and armor. Or pouches! Like, you know, the thing I got in my inventory. Wow, that sounds useful. It is. Now that I officially have my enchanter license, I've come to Ankara to set up shop. If you don't mind me asking, why didn't you just get a regular shop then? I mean, I see signs advertising space for sale. It's called money. Oh, I won't be here permanently. Huh? I plan to travel all across Dorencia. Ankara is my first stop, so I establish a customer base here before I move on. That way, when I return, I'll have business waiting. Won't people get impatient? Not to worry. I plan to set up a regular schedule so my customers never have to wonder when I'll be back. Hmm. Hence the tent. I need to be able to travel with it. I'm not so sure that's going to work as well as you think. Yes, well, one thing at a time. I have my license, I have my stand, and soon I'll have customers lined up as well. I'm not ready yet, but I should be in a few days. License? Yeah, it's not illegal, it's not illegal to practice enchanting without a license, but having it means you're fully trained. It should bring in a lot of business. Uh, okay. Okay. You need a little card that says you learned it. Plus, I want to be the best enchanter I can be, to, help, to better help people like you. Well, she really is going to travel around. It could be useful to my work as a knight to have an enchanter ally. So what did you mean when you said you're here to help people? Do you know anything about what's going on in the forest? Only, whatever ever, only what everyone else knows. Rampaging goblins, death and destruction, and a request for aid sent to the Ashen Order. Well, I'm here now and I'm gonna take care of things. Are you sure you can? No offense, I'm sure you're a great knight, but you're just one person going up an entire forest's worth of goblins. I'm not gonna fight all the goblins, I just need to find the artifact and then things should settle down. Artifact? You mean from the Acclaim? Yes, we believe there's one in the forest. I saw an Acclaim artifact once. I even touched it. What was it like? Strange. It's hard to describe, even when I try. Sorry, I just don't know how to explain it. Even our top researchers have trouble talking about the artifacts. If a knight from the Ashen Order hadn't shown up, I'm not sure what would have happened. I probably wouldn't be here. Don't worry, I'm here to take this artifact and then peace will be returning to Ankara before you know it. You sound pretty confident. I'm glad our fates are in your hands. Did she really have to put it like that? Anyway, there are guards on duty at the town gates. They might be able to give you more details. Okay. I'll go talk to them, and hopefully the gameplay will start. Move on. Oh, guards! Let's see. I could go straight to the guards, but maybe I should ask town around town a little more first. If you're looking for something, just ask me and I can point you in the right direction. My name is Marie. I manage the local inn. Oh, hello. My name is Celeste. I'm with the Ashen Order. A knight of the Ashen Order here in Ankara? No. Now I know things are serious. Yes, quite serious. This is about the trouble in the forest, I assume. Exactly. How bad is it? Pretty bad. What can you tell me about the situation? It started about three weeks ago. The goblins in the forest suddenly went berserk. I understand you had some sort of peaceful agreement arrangement with them before, is that right? Yes, Lord Aldus and the leader of the goblins signed a peace treaty. Well, we would leave the goblins alone and respect their territory. They would leave us alone while also handling any monster activity. Has their leader said anything? Not a word. I've heard rumors of other monsters in the forest, too. 
It's like they completely abandoned the deal in order to attack us. This sort of strange behavior is definitely consistent with the presence of an artifact. To tell you the truth, it's depressing. I really thought the treaty was a sign that humanity could get along with other races. It's probably not the goblins' fault. What? You mean someone else is making them do this? Not exactly. We believe an artifact from the Acclaim civilization was surfaced in the forest. These artifacts have strange effects on monsters. And the goblins are only behaving this way because of the artifact's magic did something to them? Most likely, yes. I don't understand. They were intelligent enough to ha! They were intelligent enough to sign a peace treaty. Why would the artifact affect them like any other monsters? I still don't understand the artifacts. You know, I've always wondered. Yes? They claim we're pretty advanced, right? They don't sound like the sort of who would make such horrible devices. What if the artifacts were actually left behind by their enemies? It's one of many possibilities we're keeping in mind as we study them. Well, I wish you the best of luck. Oh, and ah, God! What are these? Just a few things that might help you win your if you run into trouble. Thank you. I'll do my best to repay you. Take care of the situation in the forest, and you'll repay me many times over. I will. And if you ever need a place to stay, my indoors are always open. And if you need more information, most rumors reach me eventually. I'll keep that in mind. Bye! What a nice woman. I think I'm starting to get the hang of this. Let me see... Ah, oh, that must be one of the guards re mentioned. I'm sure he, he'll have information about what's going on in the forest. Excuse... huh? What's going on over there? Is that a funeral? One of many Ankara has seen lately. Is this because of the goblins? Yes. Oh. I didn't realize it was this bad. Many people have died. We tried to keep Ankora safe, but we can, we only can do so much. I've had to watch a lot of funerals lately. How bad is it? Do you see those graves? Yes, it's a graveyard, isn't it? A new graveyard. You mean all those graves are for people who died in the past three weeks? I'm afraid so, big bird. <laughs> I shouldn't be making jokes about death. And shit. But I'm 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 gonna give him snuffle up because his voice. Oh no! Only I got in here sooner. What? Sorry, I didn't in I didn't introduce myself. I'm Celeste. I'm with the Ashen Order. I'm Jared. Ashen Order, huh? I was starting to think the Ashen Order would never send someone to hell. I'm certain Sir Zacharias acted as fast as he could. Didn't do those people any good. I'm sorry. That doesn't change anything. I know. All I can say is that I'll do everything in my power to make sure this nightmare ends. Alright. Is there nothing I can say to make things better? Oh, if only Sir Zacharias sent me here earlier. This is exactly why Lord Aldous decided we needed an army. For times like these. But there's only so much we can do. I'm going to the forest to take care of the situation. Is there any information you can give me? Just ask the goblin that this that the goblins attack fiercely without mercy. It's like they're possessed. I understand. You're going to stop this madness? That's the plan. I wish I could go with you. Well, while I'm prepared to do this alone, I would accept help. Unfortunately I have to stay here at my post. Captain Big Bird doesn't like it when I leave the post. Even if I have to go to the bush to pee. I once peed on <laughs> Elmo. <laughs> I once peed on Elmo accidentally. Turns out he was eating some berries in a bush and I didn't see him. It was a very awkward meeting that night. Someone has to guard the town. If they aren't here, if we aren't here at our post, there might be many more graves joining the rest. Yes, you're right. Besides, they have us outmatched. Defense is all we can manage these days, and it's pushing us to our limits. Don't worry, I'll take care of it. Ugh, I feel sick after seeing those graves. I didn't know it was this bad. I'm a member of the Ashen Order. I'm going to be a knight. I should be prepared for things like this. 
Talking about something in a classroom or going through mock exercises is a lot different than seeing the graves of innocent people right in front of you. Hey, you gonna be okay? Yes, I'm fine. If you need to sit down or something, no one will mind if you use the guard barracks. Knights aren't exactly common around here, but we're all on the same side, so... No, that's alright. I'm fine, I'm fine. Wish I could stop repeating that. Uh, I don't mean any offense. Which is what everyone says right before they offend you. You seem kind of new. I'm a squire. That explains it. You don't have to be so insulting. What? But you said it yourself. You are new. I'm trying to act like a proper knight. Well, yeah, but even the most proper behavior in the world can't hide inexperience. What? Why not? Look at your gear. What's wrong with my gear? This is top-notch stuff! Sure, for someone still training. What's that supposed to- If you're heading into real danger, you need gear that's up to the task. Why would the Ashen Order sent me out unprepared? Maybe it's part of your initiation. I mean, asking around for information seems to be part of it, so I bet properly equipping yourself is too. Uh, that makes sense. Here, I have some extra armor and a spare sword you can use. What? No, I don't want to put you out. It's fine. They belong to a guard who got caught masturbating in the barracks and, uh, well, he's fired. If you're really here to help us, I'm sure he'd want you to have them. Thank you. <laughs> if you need anything else, just shout. I will. Alright, I'm feeling a little better now. It definitely sounds like there's an artifact somewhere in the forest. That should be my next stop. In this demo version, you'll be unable to travel back and forth between the town and forest. Make sure you have no unfinished business in town before you leave. I am good. I'm good. Let's do this. There's something strange here. The air feels heavy? No, that's not quite it. It just doesn't feel right to me. Am I sensing the artifact's presence? Our researchers often say it's difficult to be near the artifacts for very long. While they're studying them, they need to take regular breaks, no matter how well the research is going. Their reports include dizziness, nausea, disorientation... At least there's only one artifact here. It shouldn't have too bad of an effect on me. I just need to reach it and contain it. But if it's gotten the goblins riled up, reaching the artifact won't be easy. I'll need to be careful. So full of some controls is okay, cool. Uh, one sec. Equipment. Standard issue sword, standard issue armor, no rings, got it. How do I attack? That's my magic. Ah, uh, cool. There we go. I got this. That's my jump, that's the thing, I can't dare attack, but it's fine. Okay, this is kind of nice. It's kind of nice and fluid, and I like it. I feel like I have a lot of control over, like, where I attack, though. There's a dodge roll. And that's about it. Okay. Now where am I going? Oh, what's this? Oh, that's the interact button. Okay. Shield ring. Ooh. Uh, uh, where's my block button? That's my block button. Okay. Ow. Ah. Ah. Uh. The picture does- the avatar- on the, hang on, I'm gonna have to move my camera one sec. Her avatar doesn't really look like her that well. It looks like her hair is a little longer in the photo than it does in the game. So I'm a little uncertain if that's just like a placeholder or if that's the actual thing. Maybe I'm just overthinking it. Fuck your magic! Oh, this looks important. Oh, okay, that's not what I was thinking of. Two glowing crystals. 
Got it. Well, so much for rolling being, like, the thing that gets things moving. There's no lock-on function. Which I guess is fine, but, like... I feel like it might need it. Oh, boy. I really like, though... How you can move mid-swing, or, like... For each swing you make, you're really able to move and redirect the, uh... You're able to redirect your attacks. That's a big boss guy. What's over this way? I see a glowy. Small healing potion. Okay, cool. Take care of the ads first, and then we'll take the big guy out. Or we'll do a little bit of AoEs. Ow. Finish your ability. Oh. Cool. I don't want to do that, though. Not yet. Inventory. There we go. Done. What? Oh, I thought maybe something dropped. Uh. Okay, so these aren't bosses. They're just big guys. Sweet herb. Oh. Oh boy. Stop. Casting. Bullshit. Okay, so dodge rolling doesn't prevent damage, it just moves you out of the way a little quickly. Okay. I thought maybe it would knock- it would prevent damage, but I guess not. Maybe that's what blocking's supposed to be for, which is fine. Uh... I feel like I should have probably found the artifact by now. They did say that the map- they did feel the map was a little big. Oh boy. The developer did say they were probably going to rework the map. The first map, so it'd be a little smaller. Ow. Son of a bitch! Stop that crap. I don't want to die here and probably restart the entire demo. I don't want to know what that's like. So let's just not. Hmm. Herbs? So wait, that bar... To my side here isn't a experience bar. It's just kind of a an alt bar. Okay. But where's my experience bar? Cause I don't see one. Eh. Okay, good, I've got health. You're about to die! And how about you? You about to die? Actually, how is my... ...experience? Where does it say that? It doesn't. It does not. So I don't have an experience bar, I just have an ultimate bar. Whoa. The fuck is your combo, man? There we go. Uh... Yeah, where the hell am I going? I'm going the right way, there's enemies this way, but like... How do I know I've found the artifact? It said there were some symptoms... Of, like, being near it. So I wonder... If that's what- if it's, my screen's gonna fuck up a little bit when I'm near it. Oh boy. There we go. Maybe I should use alt the second I have it. Cause I'm just gonna get it again. Ow. 
Ow. There we go, level three. <sighs> this really is a huge map. Oh. Damn it. I thought I was avoiding damage. Turns out I'm getting my ass beat. Uh, yeah, where the hell am I going? Oh, select is the item. Okay. Select is the item menu. Alternatively, I could just hit the start button and go there myself, but like... Why do that when you can just quick select it? Nope. There we go. Let's go this way, there's more shit here. I hope the artifacts along the way in like a very linear area, not at all like... I don't know. Huh? Ah! Uh, not all like a very unlinear area, and then I have to like go digging for it or something. I mean, that would that'd be fine for the demo if it was, but like, eh. In the final product, this would be like end game level bullshit. Where you make a huge map to build up difficulty and shit. That looks important. I see a green glowy thingy off in the distance. Is that it? Is that where I need to go? Is there not a boss there? I was expecting a boss. I wonder if there even is a boss here. Hmm. Yes, yeah, like four big guys, but that's not at all like what I was expecting. Okay, that's. Oh, cool, I got a rapier. So the weapon model doesn't change, which is fine. Not every game needs to do that, but it would be a nice touch to see that. You are immortal in this demo. Fuck yeah! Alright then, I'm just gonna go hog wild. Here I was thinking I would, uh, have to worry. I thought I saw something smack me. Alright, if I'm immortal, then whatever. Okay, so... what? Balance ring... Ah, this stinks! What in the world? Is this fish? Why would anyone bring fish into the forest and just dump it here in the su to sit in the sun all day? Ew. Wait, did those goblins steal it? And Korra does have a lot of fishermen. <laughs> hmm. Sorry. I guess I'll take it back with me and see if anyone has fish stolen from them recently. No, I'm not sure they'll want it back in this condition. Yeah, they probably won't. I'm not done? Dude! I don't have access to a map! It's kind of... a little bullshit. The little, I mean, yeah, I have a mini-map, but, like, I can't expand the map and look at where the hell I gotta go left. At this point, I kind of just want to, like, speedrun through it. In fact, I'm probably gonna do that. I'm just gonna run through everybody. We've experienced the combat enough. Maybe there is a boss at the end of this. I hope. Oh, well, this is gonna be a long let's play. See goblins over there. That's probably not the artifact. But I'm gonna grab it anyway. Green leaves. 
Old wood. Ew. Ooh, another green thing. Is that fish? Or is that the artifact? I hear it I hear it twinkly. I hear twinkliness. The ground here is disturbed. It looks like someone buried something here. I better check it out just in case it's important. It's a book. Why would someone bury a book? I should hang on to it. I'm not done? Game? How long is this demo? I'm meaning to insult people, but like, wow. This is a long, this is a long game. I was not expecting that. Where the hell's the artifact? This is really long. Um, I didn't run through these people. Wait. Oh, those are mushrooms. I thought those was a skeleton or something. Hmm. Yep. I nearly missed the treasure chest. It blends in so well. Uh. Maybe this way. What? Glowing crystal. Okay. Is this the way? I feel like I'm getting near, but then again, I've been wrong before. Twice. I think it'd be over here, or something would be over here. It would be a guarded object, definitely. So where the hell... ...is it? Did I miss my chance? Is it this way? I'm... There's enemies here, so either they respawned, or... It's this way. I feel like I've been here, though. No, I haven't, otherwise I would've grabbed that item there. There's another path that way. There's nothing this way. Except for that, except for a couple extra things, but nothing, like, glowy. Hmm... Uh, I should loop back through. Yeah, it does. Okay. Okay, chainmail armor, there we go. I feel like... Uh, yeah, this is a very, very long first mission map, and I feel like there's no sense to this at the moment. Never mind, hang on, maybe I'm wrong. It seems too, like, thrown around. Like, the map is huge and things are just kind of plopped there. It's not linear, it's free roam. I haven't seen a monster like that yet. The artifact must be having an effect on it, too. I wonder what it's looking at. Ah! That must be it! The artifact responsible for all this trouble! It looks so strange. I've never seen anything like it before. Well, the sooner I get back to the Order, the closer we'll have the eh, having answers. I should be able to dash past the monster and... What? What the... What are you doing here? I'm sorry, I followed you from town. I wanted to tell you something with... Someone else was asking questions about the incidents. Uh, how am I supposed to keep a civilian safe from this monster? I'll just have to take it out before I can hurt her. Stay back, I'll handle this. Oop. Whoa! Are we going Dark Souls? Whoa, God. Let's actually try. I'm getting some, uh, I can't beat Airman vibes from this song. I like it. Oh boy. Huh? Whoa, 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 whoa. 
Okay, so we're going Monster Hunter, aren't we? Oh shit. Hmm. Shit! Oh, that's a mana potion. Damn it! Okay, whatever, I'm immortal. I'm gonna have to deal with it. This is a lot of damage for a first stage boss. Okay, it's dead. That was a lot for a first stage boss. What? Who the hell are you? She's the one who was asking questions. Did you take the artifact? The artifact is mine now. I'm an official representative from the Ashen Order, and I demand you hand over the artifact immediately. You don't understand the dangers. Make me. What's wrong? You're a knight, aren't you? Okay, okay, we went over this in my lessons. Situation 12C. An unknown human opponent attempts to interfere with the knight's responsibilities. In such a case, the knight is to establish his or her authority to resolve the situation peacefully. You are interfering with the Ashen Order's mission. As a Knight of the Order, I must insist you turn the artifact over to me. Nah. I insist. Really? That's the best you could come up with? Well, it worked out... Worked when we acted out this scenario in class. Okay, she's not cooperating. That makes this a situation in 12D? No, that's when a mob is involved. I think I'll be on my way now. 13B. What? An unknown opponent attempts to interfere with the knight's responsibilities, fails to listen to reason, and threatens the current order. Hostilities may be unavoidable. I think I'm gonna end the episode here. You're not all there, are you? Attacker. If you don't give it to me, I'll have to take it by force. I'd like to see you try. I didn't want to escalate the situation, but there's nothing I can do. I'm gonna be right back one sec. Okay. We're escalating the situation. What? Okay, never mind. Is that some sort of smoke bomb? Where did she go? Head back here! She's gone. And she took the artifact. I failed my mission. I'm sorry. It's not your fault. If you weren't trying to defend me, that girl might not have gotten the artifact. Who knows what would have happened instead. I know you thought you were what you were doing was right. There's nothing wrong with that. If you say so. So you followed me because of that girl? Yes. She was asking questions similar to yours about the forest, so I thought she would be headed in this direction. I wasn't sure if she was on your side or not. I guess we don't know the answer to that now. She must have been searching for the artifact. Unless she has a way to contain it, she'll bring danger with her wherever she goes. Will you go after her? That's not part of my mission. I need to get this quest updated in my face hole and then report back to the Ashen Order. I understand. We should get back to town. I'm gonna end this now, because this has gone on a long time and I don't want to go over an hour, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did, subscribe for more, and let me know what you think in the comments below, and thank you to Shroud and Leviel for supporting me on Patreon, and thank you to Whirlybird, Zerito Burrito, Dark Castle, and 3DS Master Gaming for supporting me on Twitch, and as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!